Rove McManus is in the building. A lot of people think, oh, hell's going to break loose. Rove and I patched things up uh, months ago, right, Jackie? You did. We and s- that was a good thing that you patched things up. And, hey, we, Rove. So- and we sorted it out in the car park before. Like, in, right. like yeah. two grown mm, yeah, men. Yeah. Two Aussie men. In a urine. Uh, who can pee the furthest competition? <laughs> yeah, I, I took a while to get started. <laughs> the flow is not what it used to be. <laughs> You know Bubbler. The, who's the bloke we had on the other day? Carney. Oh, yeah, you know Todd Carney. And Carney. isn't it, look, have what? you seen the, the whatever it yeah, is? The be, the, like, yes. just that that's the gag. They oh, obviously yeah. said, we've got this idea. <laughs> we want you to be on our new ad. Sounds great. Okay, yeah. but there's a there's a Bubbler gag. Yeah. Are you okay with that? No? Well, yeah, you still yeah. are going to do it anyway. You're going to do it regardless. Yeah. Oh, Saturday Night funny. Rove. That's what it's called, right? Yeah. Yep. It's on this Saturday. You know what it's like to get your name in the title? They can't oh. get rid of you then. Oh, that's right. You can't yeah. be replaced. No, it can't be a dumb. Saturday Night Hellier. No. Well, yeah. it could be, but it wouldn't be the same. Exactly. What are we going to see? Because Jackie and I were talking about it. Is this a half Rove Live, half uh, Sunday Night Takeaway? I think less yeah. Sunday Night Takeaway. Yeah. There's, there's, it's, it's like... It, it's li- it's a live studio on a Saturday night. We want it to have a sort of a sort of laid back sort of party vibe yeah, to it, really. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, like it's the, it's the uh, live comedy variety type show that uh, we used to do, but a 2019 version of it. Great. Uh, and yeah, not so much of the bells and whistles that we that Takeaway had, or that even we sort of had for our pilot. It was like we probably did like an hour and a half's worth of show in an hour. We probably made it a bit too crammed. Will people be drinking in the audience? Yes, Are I. We will all be drinking on set. Oh. As well, that's oh, the so, plan. Okay, Sounds good. Like, um, do you have celebrity guests in there? Yes, we've got Jess Malboy in for show one, which would be great. Right. Uh, stand-up comedian Ivana Ristogeta will be joining us as well. Um, and then we've got a... When do the, how long before the big names come on the show? Hey, uh, by you? <laughs> no, not me. Oh, come on now. Uh, now, he, I, want, I want to talk oh, about Oh, we should weddings. go on together because we've both got shows we need to promote soon. Wait, now, I, I don't want to talk about my show. I want to talk about The Masked Singer. That's yeah. what oh, I want yeah. to talk about. That looks yeah. like some kind of show, Ryan. It does. I I want to make guesses, but I'm not I'm not confident enough just Go yet. for it. Make hey, a guess. Hey, explain this to me. Yeah. How, how does it work? Yeah. Like, if you guess the celebrity, are they out? No. So every oh. every episode... That's what I thought happened. You'll see... First, you'll see six singers, because there's 12 in total. So you see the six celebrities perform right. in their disguise. And the one with the least amount of votes is the fave. Right. Gets eliminated, and then they take off their mask, and we get to see who it is. But you right. get clue packages as to who each celebrity and can is. can you hear... Like, can't you've got a mask. no? This is the thing. If, a lot John, of them, Far- if John Farnham was on the there, voice turn on you would he- you exactly. You'd hear. Work. Okay, first of all, the sound they are singing live, right. but the sound is really good because they've done because Tim Chappell did the costumes, the right. Oscar winner, and the Could acoustic. You're dropping out names. Who knows? I don't, I don't know, know who that Tim bloke Chappell. is. I don't. Know okay, he the did Oscar Priscilla. Winner. He's the a, Oscar he's winner. Okay. Oh, okay. Right, it's a big very, deal. He's a big deal. It makes all the top shelf unicorn costumes. If you need a giant one-eyed alien. He's, he's the your guy. man. He's, he's your guy. <laughs> no, he figured out the acoustics for it to sound good. But right. they, in answer to that question, there, I w- without giving much away, yes, there are some people on there where you'd think, oh, you'd guess their voice straight right, away. Okay. But they throw it. They throw it so they mimic other people's voices so we don't guess straight oh, away. I'm oh, totally confused. I am too. Oh, you At what stage it? does a judge get eliminated? I think Channel 10 hate me right now for <laughs> I'm selling that so badly. Do judges get eliminated? <laughs> no, we don't get eliminated. There are no judges. Do when your do votes we? count? Yes. Okay. Yeah, yeah they right. count. And do we so see the, the drama between Hughesy and Lindsay unfold on the show? No. Because there were, uh, there's not really. No, I saw no Juicy said something like, as a tongue in cheek joke that turned into worldwide news. They started reporting it as fact yeah. in America. And call it, and because I don't know who he is, yeah. calling him David Hughes. Yes. Yeah. Comedian <laughs> David Hughes. <laughs> well, and look, then, we'll then, hopefully get some Margie Bargie going. Yeah. yeah. Now, do you have a uh, puppet on the show at all? Because I, well, I want yeah. a wise cracking head on a stick. Yes. Do you have so, anything are you like around? That? Would you like to be? I'd Would love you, to do that. It'd be a great job. But that Aussie well, ostrich, he's not doing anything. Get him out of retirement. I think Ozzy is in a museum somewhere. Is he? We got Judith Lucy, oh, so she's she great. will be hanging shit on me for most of the night. What about Agro? Would you bring? Would you put Agro on there? I've heard Agro is around still. Yeah, it's like he's still oh, alive. Carl's obsessed with Agro. I loved Agro. He grew up with Agro. Did you ever work with him? I didn't work with him. Before I was in radio, I used to be one of those pests that would annoy the person on the radio, and I'd show up to everything, and I'd show up at the radio oh. station. I'd even pretend that we had a fake meeting and that I was shocked as to <laughs> someone must have. I didn't what know a why. Loser. Yeah. What? Oh, it's just meant to be here. Because I just assumed, would he do, 
if you were like, like if Agro was here, yeah. would he have the puppet? Like, oh, yeah, you, yeah, every the time puppet. I've run into Jamie Dunn, who controls Oh, the yeah. she's done it. She's I know, gone sorry, there. I've gone she's there. She's revealed You've the mask singer he, for Agro. He, 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 he had it with him. He has it in like an overnight bag. And I said, do you have Agro? And he goes, yep. And he, he opened always the bag. has Agro. Agro's always with him. Pulls Agro out. Hello, Jackie. Yeah. Look, well, that's it, right? I just assumed then, does he duck under the desk? Yes. And that's all part of the film. That's not even when Agro's here. He does that quite happily. I know, right? But have you ever thought of putting a puppet on, or was that just not a part of it? Look, I like—I don't mind the idea of a puppet. Do you know the puppet um, Randy? No, there's a puppet called Randy. Who is that? He's very funny. Like, it just sort of, he's, he's um, is I don't he know, a you had... porn puppet. What is he? <laughs> <laughs> Who is Randy this? the you porn? Well, that's a that's pilot week 2021. <laughs> I don't know who the hell that puppet is? Um, no, he's a, he's a comedy puppet who performs around quite a bit. He would be great. I now we, now now you got me thinking we should have a puppet. What about that dog? Didn't Conan have some filthy talking dog? Oh, Triumph, the insult yes, comic dog. That was a good puppet. Yes. So okay. you want a like a bad puppet? Do you know what I'm puppet. seeing now? What? I'm seeing there could be a great idea, and we've still got, you know, we've got pl- enough shows to get this out, where we have a string of puppets mm-hmm. who perform to be the, the puppet, pu- the puppet side, puppet like idol, a, a puppet idol, mm. and we vote one out every week. Mm. The puppetette, like a bachelor, like an the idol, puppet, like, yeah. the puppet, the puppet, it's great. It's exactly right. I like, and this you idea. have to guess whose whose fist is up. That's like <laughs> the, the great twist at the end of now it. Now I'm starting to like, like this there's show. A show. There's this a show, show I'm going to watch so now. You we should guys, get together more often. You guys I'm both I'm did your shows as part of Pilot Week, yes. yeah. and and Rove and Kyle, you both got picked up. When's yours coming? I don't know if it you've even recorded is, uh, them all. They're all done. I, re- I there was a day where I saw the set going in. Oh yeah, yeah, I've done that. Uh, I've done it all. Yeah, uh, I believe they're all done and they're and it's finished. Do you are you one of those people who sit in the edit suite and then? Oh like, God, I have no. no. I sit at no, home and I watch do. it and then I I spew at someone. Yes. And I go, why? Have the, what happened to this bit? This bit? This bit? And yeah. they go, oh, we cut it down for time. And I said. <laughs> I refuse to have gold cut away for time. Do you know how much I love that? I love that the idea that, and you are a very busy man, you have things on, so the idea that you would say, no, I'm not going to be in on the edit mm-hmm. process. I'll just tell you afterwards <laughs> yeah. what, and then you can I, do it again. what I'm mad about. Well, you next can time, do it again. Next time, do you want to come in and be part of the edit process? No, no. I still don't want to do that. <laughs> That's true. That's the least thing I want to do. They're boring people in the edit suites. Oh, they don't so, see enough natural daylight. No. Who, who is doing Pilot Week now? Because it's coming soon. Roxy? Yeah, Roxy's doing her She's own got reality one. show. I assume. Are you going to be on that one too? No, I don't think so. How did you not get a Guernsey on that? She was hanging around Roxy, being fr- trying now, to be a friend, and then she got assholed out of now that. Now, you have, have you heard about how, like, the day I called in, and you and guys yes. patched we, things up? Yeah, like, you caught up the, that, that day. day yes. we were out at uh, at Icebergs, and yes. just happened to be across the table from each other. Yes, yes. I did hear planned. about that. I said that that was something dodgy. Felt <laughs> smelled weird. So <laughs> Roxy was there. I thought, oh, maybe maybe that was a powwow for the show. No, well, she did tell me at that lunch she was doing the show, but oh. she said um, they asked to bring cameras to that lunch, and she said no, don't do that. Oh, so she was actually shooting it at the time. So she was shooting it right. at the time. She didn't want you on camera. She knew I wouldn't want to be, you know. Talking about. So she she lured you in only to say that there are no cameras. Is that how she got lunch out of you? Is that what it was? <laughs> yeah. Why don't you come and and then and then you got catfished and that could have been the catfish. Yeah, show. that could have been. Oh, the catfish show isn't happening no, anymore. Th- they couldn't find people to be catfished. That's weird, isn't it? Were they only going to just was it? They just couldn't find anyone in Australia because we do catfish segments here and we always get. People. Who knows? Well, Casey's story is an amazing story anyway. You know, she yeah, became a sex addict. She'd just show up to people's story. houses like it was Idol Live, and uh, then Casey would show up and have sex with people. Just random people? Yeah. Like this was thing that the that catfish the, show? No, the millennials. No, that uh, wasn't the show. Right. That was what she was doing when she was addicted to sex. Yeah. Jackie hasn't person. gone through that phase yet. No, no. Mm-hmm. Still <laughs> I know, there's the, still the hope. Hang on, over, guys. Yes. I, want, I want to get me uh, Ed Grove's phone number. I've, I've been calling him. He's just not responding. Is there an What message could he there? possibly no, be up to? No, he just keeps ringing. Uh, keeps what? ringing. Sorry, is Agro's dance card <laughs> full at the moment? Yeah, I know. <laughs> Sorry. He's appearing at a Westfield Centre in Queensland. Put on callback for you. Little plastic ring, hand gonna, is gonna, doing signings <laughs> today. I'm going to try and ring him anyway. We'll just keep talking amongst it because a, a puppet would be amazing to have on the show. Yeah, well, you've got to give him time to put aggro on his hand. Yeah, I reckon he gets his fist it. in that thing pretty quickly. I think he sleeps with it on. I imagine that. Oh, I do on. bedroom characters. Imagine what you could do if you had aggro in there. That'd be a whole three way. Yeah, so yeah. What's a bedroom character? Like role playing? Yeah, yeah. not sort of, but fully committed. 
Hi, the was... person you have called is not... Ah, oh, forget, sorry. Is, Agree, that like missed a, out. is that like a fluffy? No, that's where okay. you get into a big, like a Humphrey Bear yeah. outfit. Yeah, and Jack that's, is, that's has your no jam. idea what we're talking about. But oh, I not like. Oh, that. this could be a great because t- so I tried to do a So these are people who get turned on mm-hmm. by wearing costumes. Yeah. Yes. like oh hello, I'm yeah. seeing a little connection here. Mars Singer, singer yeah, people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same thing. So you will probably get the fluffy fetish audience for your show. Probably. They'll be yeah. like, Ugh, all this annoying singing is getting in the way of me <laughs> watching someone dressed as a lorikeet. <laughs> that's mental. <laughs> But I did try and make a puppet here. Uh, the world. Oh, yes. Remember that puppet? Where's the puppet? Yeah, where did Can that go? Can someone bring it in? Yeah, I'll, I'll get it now. Uh, you, you, hang on. You were making I a made a puppet. puppet. Yeah, I wanted yeah. to bring the puppet back because puppets were big on the radio. Puppets Agro are great. was here back yeah, in the sure. heyday with Wendy Harm and all right. that. That's right. Up in Brisbane, there was Aussie Austria. Aussie was great. Pup, we, we had to have a puppet for it to be successful. That's weird. I'm glad. Oh, times what have about da- uh, David Strassman? He had little Chuck. Oh, that was weird, though. That shit. It was creepy that, that stuff. That was weird. Right. I bought what a did, was Middle your... Eastern puppet, right. so I'm skewing, uh, skewing out for the audience. Sure. You were How Indian. You wanted an Indian. An Indian. I wanted Indian. But it looked Middle Eastern. It came white. I thought, how do you get a white Indian? Mm. So you, oh, so you didn't make it. You had it sent out. That's of course, right. it's like the yeah, edit suite. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Tell people what you on want. Amazon. If you don't like it, complain. Where is the puppet? Does anyone know where it is? You guys got no idea. No, oh, sorry, Kyle. I think it's gone missing. This, I'm oh, sick and tired of shit no. going missing this, around here. For the listener, there are people madly scrambling around this building, opening cupboards, looking for. For a, for a potentially mildly racist puppet, <laughs> from what I'm hearing, you know. So every, you you wanted an Indian puppet, yes, and, and it looked like this. Hello, hello, Rob. I would love very much to appear on your show. How could that possibly go wrong? I have I've done the Uber, I've done the taxi, I've done the Seven Eleven, I've done every job. Now I want to be a television star. Do you worry that you haven't been fined enough? <laughs> is that what it is? <laughs> <laughs> you haven't <laughs> you haven't got in trouble enough no, over the years. Abdullo is a uh, that's his name. Abdullo. Right. He's a lover. Not a hater. He's a lover oh, and is nice. is uh, very proficient in every page of the Karma Sutra. Da- oh, my li- da- now lift my little felt leg above my shoulder there. There you go. Does he? You put your to- fist in a bit harder, Mr. Kyle. So, okay, okay. Abdullah, yeah. <laughs> See, See, I can do- talk to him and everything. See how you don't need the puppet though. No, but I, I'm seeing this now with our for eyes, television. Of course, it, we the- do have cameras for the for the yeah. you know social. This is for your course. show. I'm Are you interested in Abdullah? Uh, take it Look, or leave it one time it can, offer. It can be one. Well, then I'll leave it. It can be if, if it's as open and it's shut more as than that. a one time offer. Uh, so come on, it's an open ended offer. We've got to develop this up a bit. We'll do some off. workshops. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no puppet? We're looking everywhere. No, you know still, what? We're still looking for this puppet. Lou's got it, so we're tracking Lou Why down. Is, what the hell's the bloody... Uh, how, the, was now, the, how, was, how was he even allowed to leave the building? This is this is what I worry about. Our, Here we go. This guy has been working. He's about 60. He's our groundskeeper, right? He's a groundskeeper. He's, on the phone. he's a groundskeeper. He's, no. He has the variety car downstairs with all the lights and everything on. He's one of those types, you know, oh. charity type. Yes, right. Why would the groundskeeper... Have taken down to the basement in his little workshop where he just sits alone by himself with all his tools. Why would he take my little Indian puppet? He no. threw it out, Kyle. <gasps> I'm sorry. He's dead. Yeah, he said that he put it was in a it was in a set of drawers. Get him on, get him on the phone. I don't know where to look. On the get phone. Him on the this phone. is <laughs> unbelievable. Sorry, Rove, in the middle of your interview. Talk, you're here to talk about Saturday Night Rove. This is really rough. We were in the middle of <laughs> Abdullah, launching, poor Abdullah. which could have been one of the next greatest television puppets. Yeah. <laughs> But Rove, this puppet hasn't been spoken about in three years. It doesn't matter. Does it not the point? <laughs> no wonder it's been thrown out. I don't know where I'm looking, but I'm mad. <laughs> is he there? Where Lou. is he? Lou, oh, we need okay. to talk to Can you to put Lou, Lou on the yeah. phone for me, please? There he is. Yeah. Is Lou. this the groundskeeper guy? Yeah. Okay. Lou. Yeah, good morning. Uh, it's oh, Kyle Lou. and Jackie O'Rove's here as well. Lou, I'm here on a very, very dark day. Oh, Lou, we're trying to... Like, Rove has come and asked... Well, I've asked Rove since he's here. His show's on I Saturday night. I brought it up. I said, what about you? We need a puppet. Yeah, and I said, I've got Abdulu the puppet. They said you had him. Then you told them you threw Abdulu out. We did, unfortunately. We Why? Had to, we, we had to do clean-ups. Uh, the, the show, the show. I can't keep. Uh, I don't have storage where to keep all the stuff. Hang on, you've got shit down there from WSFM when it was two yeah, W. You're you've got you're signs downstairs with shit. Hans and Kaylee that are dead now. They've yeah. been dead for forty years. You've still got shit down there with them, but that's you've mem- thrown up a- memories. Memories. Yeah. Well, what about Abdullah's memories? <laughs> that's right. His l- lovely little Kama me. Sutra it's, jokes. <laughs> He's gone. I, I can go and buy one. The, the no, no. Could you not have donated him at least? 
no, unfortunately, unfortunately, it was, uh, it was dusty and, and it had to go. It's disgusting. Why was it disgusting? Dusty. What have you done to it? It was dusty. dusty. Oh, there, there, I can't was, understand. That was three years ago. Abdullah disappeared three years ago. Now you ask me for Abdullah. <laughs> Yeah, but look, everyone, we all have our comebacks. I'm yeah, here. Yeah. I'm Dusty. You're going to throw me out? You are eternal. You will last forever. Oh, okay. Now, Lou, I like what, this guy now. Can I ask, what did you do to that puppet down there before you threw him out? Yeah, well, we did, we did, uh, we did uh, the clean-up, and, and, I, and I said, are we going to use this puppet again? And I said, I decided. Who did you ask that to, that question? I decided. Uh, well, uh, but you have uh, no I authority I mean, to decide anything. Well, well, well. We all, we all have. A, you, you have. You're doing things that from time to time, and, and you have to do it on the spot at the moment. No, so, so you uh, just decided on your own back. I have no authority, but I went ahead and I done it. Well, I had to pay oh, the penalty. So, I will pay the penalty, Carl. He's gone rogue. <laughs> it's what do you do? Does happen, this shit happen in TV world? I, I, look, no, we, we protect our puppets. You yeah, protect everything. <laughs> they have are a, in do a, you think Agro was thrown out? Do you think Aussie Ostrich was thrown out, Lou? Or do you think these things have been kept he for is a, Aussie is a museum piece. Agro will be there as well. Yeah. I think Jamie Dunn would have been. Where, where is Humphrey be better? Where, where Humphrey's gone? Humphrey's, Humphrey's around. Fool. Humphrey's yeah. around. Yeah. Don't, you, don't you drag Humphrey's name into the mud. <laughs> <laughs> Humphrey was up for sale. I nearly bought Humphrey. Are you kidding? He was like the production company that owns Humphrey. <laughs> they were going to sell him. They were going to sell him. And I, I was like, you how, got how much would Humphrey cost? And then it ended up that they were okay. But I was very close to going, how great would it be just to be able to have Humphrey yeah, whenever you want Humphrey? Cool. Oh, there you go. That'd you want to live the dream yeah, of... Yeah, I know. Humphrey never spoke. He was like a mute, wasn't and he, he? And he wore no pants, which oh, would no. be questionable in 2019. Lou, we'll have to have a chat after the show because we can't keep I will. Talking. I will. I, I, I apologise. That's it's one right. of those things. I'm very upset. Yeah, no, I know you, you. You probably won't talk to me for six months, but anyway, whatever. <laughs> Would you talk to him every other day? I never. He suggests speak. like, oh, because we normally catch up for coffee in the afternoon. <laughs> Adam, so now the, the Adam, replacement Adam, is we that? brought a sex doll. Uh, Adam, we, we can't doll. use your little. You keep that for yourself. That's a sex doll, Adam. Blow up one at that. And you know Good what? Luck with, I don't know. What? I don't know how many lips have inflated uh, that. Yeah. I tell you what, Adam. You blow that up. You make love to it. But the sad part no. is washing it out at the end. Uh, that's mm-hmm. where you feel humiliated. Yeah. You know what I'm saying, Rove? I think he does. <laughs> 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 You've never done a doll. No. no. I've done very well for right. myself. I've I have had no yeah. need for a doll ever. I've I've once done a blow up sheep. You oh, have I've not seen I have. No, they're say gag that. Ones, no, 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 they're no, they're gag ones. no, you can still do them. <laughs> in what capacity? I didn't finish off in it. I just, well, of course, because you're, you're a very sane person. You're not, you're not I, weird. I, I you're what, not weird. No, no. I had sex with an inflatable <laughs> sheep, but that's it. I'm not weird, guys. It's all right. There we go. Brooklyn, have you ever done anything like that? No. What about no, the, no. is there an inflatable man? Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, guess there so. is. Yeah, there would be. Okay, now I want to know what inflatable options you have. What is the average... Inflatable person, they they're all very high tech now anyway. They, yeah. Well, they've advanced a lot more than what I've Adam's actually, got over there. I've actually got the staff to buy one of those that sex like robots. You get out of a show that's bag. No yeah, good. That's I've no got good. them to buy one of those sex robots that actually is going to show up in about four months. That looks exactly like Jackie. Well, I said what? the proper thing. Hang on. That, yeah, took, the, that the, took a turn I was not expecting. You no, know, the proper doll. You know, the, like, the, not a blind. It one, looks a exactly. It, does it looks for real. So it was created, and it just happens to look like you. No, like, no, no, no. We sent off the photos. It, you, oh, okay. You, you can, you can get it. Now to you realise this anyone. is what happened with your little puppet. So yes. we might get something that comes back looking completely <laughs> different. <laughs> It'll. Yeah, I hope it looks exactly the same. And what's the what's the aim of your? <laughs> Robo Jack. We're going to uh, we're going to do a contest of okay. listeners that w- what they would want to do with Jackie no, if they could get her. I don't think we are. And then uh, the prize will be you get the robot doll. Okay. No. Now, if I can offer one word of advice, yeah. Mm-hmm. Just think about where you're going to store it afterwards. Yeah, yeah. that's a problem. That's it, problem. It, it might get thrown out. I'm uh, just saying. I want to see the show now. At first of all, I was thinking I'll be busy Saturday. But mm. the, who am I what kidding? Do, what do you do on a Saturday? Just usually get high and just sit around. Oh, well, this would be perfect for you. Uh, are you are you'll entertain me? Yeah, absolutely. And it goes for an hour. Yes. Yeah. We'll see. A, go yeah. a bit longer. I feel like I want to just keep it loosey goosey. Exactly. Yeah. I mean, I think what are we going to? We'll piss off the people who want to watch the ambulance episode. Yeah. Like, I don't know what else. Say. There is nothing else what? on the Channel 10 slate. Are you filming that. it in Sydney or Melbourne? We'll be here in Sydney, yes. Ah, good. Um, uh, oh. All t- studio tickets are all gone, which is very nice. That's great. That's good. Um, so, um, yeah, we're, I'm excited. It feels like, you know, you're revving your engines and you're waiting for the green light to go so we yes. can just get it started. Yeah. Green yeah. light goes green. 
That's seven thirty Saturday night. Yes, Saturday night. Rove, it's called Rove. It's good to have you in studio. Thanks Puppets for coming TBA. in. TBA. Thanks, yeah. guys. I'll let you know. We'll I'll see watch you. the show. I'll tell you whether I think it needs a puppet or not. Come <laughs> in for the edit. Up. I want your edit. No, I won't be there. I want your edit. I'll edit from home. Rove McManus this morning. <laughs>